Hello everybody and welcome back to Kid Source. Today we're trying out a new Minecraft map, Footscray City. Hey everybody, it's old dad back with Kid Source. Today we're trying out a new Minecraft map and it is a really cool one. It's a huge city map and the name of it is Footscray City. Now, the creator of this map did a great job, and if you want to check them out, there's a link for their Twitter in the description. Also, if you want to download the map to check it out for yourself, there's a link for that in the description also. Just follow the link and download the map, and you can check out Footscray City. Alright, so there's a signboard when we first come in, and we want to take a quick look at that and make sure we give credit to the creator. It says, Welcome to the city of Footscray founded on the 12th of December from MCPE version lots of stuff lots of stuff here I'm not gonna read it all you guys can read all that whenever you try the map I am going to point out right here uh, Republic of Astoria Republic of Astoria that is the creator and the official account for Twitter is rep underscore Astoria as you can see on the screen there so the creator says on this signboard, check out the map and let me know what you think on Twitter. So there's their Twitter and I put a link in the description if you want to let them know how cool the map is. Alright, we're going to run through the tunnel here and try to get started on the city. I'm going full speed here folks, we're not holding up. No. Okay, so we made it through the tunnel here. It's kind of a little tunnel just leading away from the, the signboard there. And look at this car, first thing we run into besides the streets and the tunnel. It's a nice little car here. It's got plenty of detail on it. And, uh, I mean, as far as Minecraft cars go, this is pretty sweet. And I'm just going to stop and show it to you because uh, there's a lot of detail in this map. And I want to show you all the detail that uh, this creator put in this map. Look at these streets with the street lights over them. Cars going up and down them. I mean, this is like a real city. Here's a helicopter. Probably a traffic helicopter with... Captain Herb Emery. Whoa, oh, the traffic looks pretty bad out here today, kid. But it's moving a little bit and we're going to be late getting into the city this morning. So, I'm going to go down a little bit closer here. Show you how detailed the streets are. Yet another vehicle here that looks like a little ambulance or a jeep or something. We go down here to the intersection. They've got crosswalks. The yellow lines painted in. We've got traffic signals here. Look at that. I mean, there's just detail everywhere in this map. This had to have taken months and months to build. I don't, I don't think this was a build team. It, it just says the creator and gives a Twitter account there. So I don't know if it's a build team, if it's just one, uh, you know, individual builder or what. But no matter who did it, they put a lot of work into this city map, Footscray City. So just going along here, checking out some more details. I see a ladder here. We're going to climb up this and just check it out. Uh, I believe this is an apartment building. Uh, it sort of looked from the outside like it had a lot of individual units. So we'll just go in one and check it out here. Oh, I, I can see already. I'm trying to get the door closed. I can see already it's got a double basin sink there. I love that. Got some nice seating areas in here. This has got to be the kitchen with the refrigerator here and a furnace and table and everything you need in a kitchen. If it was my apartment, I would be in there right now smoking some ribs. But anyway, here's the uh, bathroom. Had to go through the bedroom to get to that. Got a little bit of water in the tub there. Must not have drained out good. I've seen that happen a lot before. Okay, so that's an apartment, and I'm going to assume that uh, all the rest of these apartments are just about the same. As you can see, we're going floor to floor. We'll just peek in this one. Eh, it's not exactly the same, but it's apartments, okay? So, pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. What is pretty awesome to me is that the buildings are furnished. A lot of these bigger maps, you go in, and there's nothing inside the buildings. I have been... Uh, I don't want to say so, but I have been guilty of that myself uh, to build a map with a lot of big buildings on it and call it a city and then it's just the buildings. There's nothing There's nothing at all inside the buildings. They're just empty. Whereas this Footscray city, it seems like all the buildings are furnished and decorated and have things in them to make them look a lot more realistic. So if you wanted a map, you know, that you wanted to maybe make an adventure or 
just do some let's play. Uh, this is a really good detailed map. I tell you what, this would be an awesome map for doing some hide and seek. There are millions of places to hide in here and it's just, you know, the perfect scenario for some hide and seek. You got dozens of different levels so you can get at different altitudes there, different elevations. Uh, you got a million doors and ladders and stuff to crawl in and up and down and go hide somewhere and tons of things to hide behind. Even if I saw you go into one of these buildings, I don't think I could ever find you if we were playing a rousing game of hide and seek. Now, I did see something pretty cool. I think it's back here. It's a skywalk. Check this out. It's awesome. It's a skywalk that goes between the buildings so you don't have to get out in the weather. You see those in the real cities and that's why I just think it's totally awesome. This creator left nothing to chance. Yes, it's quite a detailed city, and I'm super impressed with this. If you're looking for a good city to just explore, to just walk around, maybe get yourself an apple at the corner apple stand, eat your apple, throw the core to a pigeon, watch them put the seeds out, it's a great map. It's a great map for doing stuff like that. We're down here along the beach, and I'm just going around letting you check out some of the buildings here. We'll zoom in a little bit closer here and you can see just detail after detail. It's like a real working, breathing city. And if I could live in any Minecraft city, I think it would probably be Footscray City. Uh, there's so much stuff to do. I love to grab my snowboard, throw it on the top of my Jeep and run up to the mountains which are nearby. Get a little snowboarding in. Yeah, bruh. Before I head back to Footscray City, I live in this apartment building that's totally cool totally furnished. It's got totally plush couch and furniture and I love it. Yeah, Footscray City is full of excitement, folks. As you can see down here by the beach or the shore, there's lots of colorful little pillars there and I'm just going to follow the road on down a little ways and kind of give you a view of everything on each side of the road. Yes, as I walk up and down the streets of Footscray City, I almost feel like Kurt Russell in Escape LA or Escape New York, one of his hit movies from the 80s and 90s where he was trapped inside the seedy underbelly of New York City or Los Angeles. It seems almost too realistic as I wander around the streets looking from side to side, wondering, wondering aloud, am I dreaming? Is there such a Minecraft city that is so realistic, so chock full of details? Yes, and it is called Footscray City. Dare I say, one of the most ingenious Minecraft maps I've ever come across. Seemingly taking months, if not years, to construct, Footscray City sprawls along a beautiful bulkhead beach with white, sandy pillars and dunes. So, that's going to do it for our video today. This has been Old Dad for Kid Source. Be sure and smash that like button if you like the video. Hey, and be sure and go subscribe to Kid Source if you haven't done that already. And be a part of the Kid Source Force. We need more people on the Kid Source Force. That's what we call our subscribers, the Kid Source Force. Because you're a force to be reckoned with. We love you, and we'll see you next time.